I'm in the pediatric research track. It is a track that dedicates three months of time throughout my the second and third years of training to work on a project of my choice. So I chose the research track because I'm interested in an academic specialty, either HEMONC or the pediatric ICU. So I can do a project that combines both and have mentors in both specialties. The faculty um, obviously get the residents started in the tracks um, and really are, are really close mentors with them all throughout uh, the two years that the residents spend in the track. Um, they help them develop the individualized learning experiences that they're gonna have in the tracks. They help them with the scholarly projects that the residents accomplish in the tracks. So I chose the research track um, because I think it would help me get into a fellowship. Um, I think it would also get me started on a project that I can continue into fellowship. Um, and by developing a specific research interest, I think it could be taken further, whether it's through fellowship, through the beginning of becoming an attending. The project that I'm working on right now is teaching my co-residents, teaching fellows and teaching attendings in the Division of Pediatrics how to perform ultrasonography. Granted, three months of research is not a lot of time to develop a project to uh, create, an, create an IRB and submit it and to uh, execute the project and also to write it up. So coming into this, it is good if you already have an idea of what you're interested in or if you um, have already found a mentor. For those that are applying to the program, it is important to know that the, there is a high expectation and high quality of work that is expected. So it's not just three months of getting a little bit of experience in and writing a little tiny paper. They do, uh, this is University of Florida and we are expecting high quality work. 